New Jersey has a complicated history with the sports betting law it's trying to fight. After all, one of its former lawmakers was the one who originally sponsored it. In 1991, then-Senator Bill Bradley first proposed limits on state-sanctioned sports betting. He played in the NBA before entering politics and thought gambling could lead to rigged games. When Congress passed the Professional and Amateur Sports Protection Act in 1992, the four states that already legalized various kinds of wagers were grandfathered in. Because Atlantic City was a powerful gambling destination in the 90s, Congress actually gave New Jersey Jersey a whole year to approve sports betting. But the state assembly couldn't get it done, and now Governor Chris Christie is fighting federal law at the Supreme Court. A lot of Christie's motivation lies in potential revenue. He says nearly $149 billion is gambled on sporting events each year. 